Do you have problematic skin? Have you been missing your facials at the salon because of the pandemic? Do you wish to even out your skin tone so that you don't need to wear makeup before going out? If your answer was yes to any of the above, then I feel like this device is for you. Right here on my hand is the W Skin Aqua Facial Device. This is a Korean device and they reached out to me and wanted me to try their at-home aqua facial device and I was more than happy to do so because I was experiencing a lot of skin issues especially lately within the past few months. My forehead especially was getting super oily and I was getting all these very pesky stubborn uh, reoccurring blemishes that I could not get rid of and it really stressed me out because I'm someone who never really had major skin issues. When they reached out to me I could not wait to try it out because I have heard about this device before and I had really really high hopes. So in this video I'm gonna be doing my full review. I've actually used this machine twice now. Two weeks ago I used it for the very first time and I filmed my first impression review. I decided not to post that review because I didn't want to just make a first impression review. I really wanted to see if it did what it said it would do and that my skin would improve over time and I wanted to use it another time so to really give it a full 28 days. And I can tell you right now that I highly recommend it if you're looking for an at-home solution to clear out some of your problem areas or if you just want to do at-home aqua facial instead of having to go to the salon because it's a lot more difficult now with the pandemic. So I'm just going to give you an overview of what it comes with, the packaging, and then I'll get into the whole review with my bare face and we'll walk you through the whole process, what are the improvements that I've been seeing on my skin and how it looks like the before and after. Everything has been deconstructed, I just wanted to show you how the packaging comes with. So it comes with the outside shipping box, the device that came into this box, instruction manual that also tells you uh, more about the machine. Everything is in English, proper English. So this manual tells you about troubleshooting, how to use it, all the components that it comes with, and also their suggestion on how to use the machine. So you just charged your device via the USB cable. And this whole thing is not only the storage box, but it's also the charging dock. So when I open the cover, which is a magnetic cover, you'll find the device on the inside. Two additional filters, your cleaning tips of three different sizes, small, medium, and large. With every purchase, you get one bottle of their cleaning solution. In here, you have 50 milliliter of the aqua facial solution. As you can see, there are two pins right there. That's what charges this machine. This whole unit here feels very sturdy and the box feels quite solid and hefty. So it definitely feels very high quality. Inside is where you would have your two compartments. This is for the clean aqua solution and this is the discharge solution so as you can see i have just used it earlier it was originally a clear liquid on this side but of course after it went through the machine then it came out like this so this was all the little sediments as well as all the filaments all the sebum all the dry skin all the blackheads that was on my skin that it was able to extract ever since that first treatment i saw my skin improve to the point where um i don't have to wear makeup anymore basically what you see right now on screen is spot concealing here 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 and maybe in the middle right here and then also under the eye and that is it. So right now what you see is just basically a lot of blush, a lot of lipstick and uh, you know my brows and my eyelashes and that basically it aside from the concealing. So this device really saved my skin. It really did what it was supposed to do and I cannot recommend it anymore. So let's jump into the review portion and I'll see you in my bare face. You're supposed to put 10 milliliter of solution in the device. So let's do that. It's marked right here. So 510. That's about right. There we have it. The exfoliating solution right here. And then this side will collect all the uh, used solution. I'm just going to follow the instructions right here. We're going to do the forehead excluding the eyebrows with the large cleaning tip on level two and then the cheeks on level one with the medium tip and then level three which is the more deeper clean on the nose and chin area. I already washed my face and I only uh, sprayed my face with my toner. I'll link all the products that I use down below obviously so you 
can uh, see what I used. Uh, so yeah, let's get started with the forehead. Like I said, this is the W Skin Aqua Facial Device. It is one of the best and very, very popular Korean device. It is known as Aqua Peel or Hydra Facial in English countries. Essentially what this does is that it thoroughly sucks out the gunk out of your skin. So out of the pores that are clogged, out of the problematic areas, and it allows your skin to heal. And the more you use it, the more clear it is. So this at home Hydra facial device has been officially been integrated into my skincare routine. Whenever you wanted a deeper clean of your skin, then you use it. So it is recommended to use it once a week for very oily skin, or in the case of mine, I have drier combination skin, so I only used it every two weeks. If you have any of these skin concerns such as rough skin texture, blackheads, acne, enlarged pores, skincare not absorbing, if you have dull skin, excess sebum, any of these issues which basically are all issues that I had, then this is the solution for you to get rid of some of these problems. So Hydra Facial is nothing new. It's a service that you can get at salons. It is a combination of physical and chemical exfoliation. It's a very effective way of combining suction, which is the mechanical exfoliation, and the chemical solution comes from the exfoliating solution. So it's a combination of the two. It creates this vortex and dissolves and really gets into the pores to extract the impurities. Finish with my forehead. Uh, it's a little red, but it doesn't hurt at all. So you are supposed to get a little bit red because it's sucking your skin. If there's not enough solution coming out, you can just sort of press on your skin, then the solution will start coming out. And at first I thought it wasn't sucking. So I was like, oh, is this really doing it? But you just have to like, wait till it sucks and then you um, just glide it and it works really well. And of course, you can also concentrate on your most problem area, um, meaning that you can go back and redo the problem areas a few more pass. So that's what I did. I try to really concentrate on this middle area, just above the eyebrows and also in the middle of uh, my forehead right here. I definitely have more of the enlarged pores right here. Oh, wow, we actually used up quite a bit. Maybe I overdid the forehead, but it's okay. We'll just keep going. As you can see, this side is the dirty side where it sucked out the gunk from my face. And yeah, I have about 2.5 milliliter left. So I'll just, uh, I'll just top it up to 10 again because I definitely want to do more. Actually, I'm going to skip right through the chin, nose, and eye area uh, because I just, you know, my cheeks are fine. After even just one use, you will notice that your skin is more hydrated. It also visually shrinks the pores as the impurities are extracted. It says that your skin care will penetrate up to 20 times more. It can even out your skin tone because by removing the dead skin cell barrier, then your glowing skin underneath can resurface. So essentially what this machine does is that it does the aqua peel, it does the microdermabrasion, and it hydrates your skin all at the same time. Which you're not able to do with your regular skincare routine. Even if you exfoliate your skin, you're just doing it from the physical surface, whereas this really gets into your pores. Okay, I'm officially obsessed with this machine and how smooth it made my skin. Only can describe it to you because it would be hard to see on the camera. I'll try my best to put some close up. But basically, like I said earlier, my T-zone was my problem area and I had a lot of bumps and clogged pores, but now I can definitely feel the difference. I just washed my face and spray my toner again. And I can feel while I was washing my face, all the areas that were really bumpy, especially on the nose, around the nose, especially around the side of the mouth and the jawline and here, like basically this whole area was smoothed out. I was so impressed because no matter how much exfoliation that I do, it doesn't remove it like this machine just did. And of course, 
we haven't been able to go to a salon or do facials not that i really did a lot of that before but we haven't been able to do it because of all the closures and lockdowns yes we are reopening a bit more now but it's still i don't know how i feel about going yet but anyway this just solved this whole gunk problem that i've been having the past year or so even with my forehead which is my most problematic area it has larger bumps it still has smoothed out i can tell you it did i feel like it's gonna get better as i do more treatments so if you have oily skin you can do this once a week if you have dry skin you can do it every two weeks let's talk about what i've noticed so far the redness from getting the suction on your skin goes away really fast as i was getting more comfortable with the, with the machine i just moved up to level three for my entire face so i'm not saying that you should do that but i was able to do that on my face especially after i've already done all the steps and then i wanted to just keep on going and just use up the the solution i just continue with the medium tip because that was kind of like the best size right in the middle and went back to all the problem areas that I wanted to concentrate on. So I have some, you know, some clogged pores right here above the eyebrow, of course, this area, and then some, a few here. Uh, I went back around my chin. I really concentrated on the ones that were beside my mouth. The, those ones I get clogged all the time. The jawline, I always get clogged and you know there's a bit of bumps there it's not like terrible or anything but i can tell you i'm not even joking i'm obsessed it has smoothed down and only after one use and even my um right here which is the problem area for everybody this machine starts beeping if you tilt it too much and if the solution starts touching the metal part in here in these uh in the other container in the discharge container so uh just a warning the other thing is that i felt like this base right here it's uh, supposed to conceal these bottles but the fact that the design is so rounded on the bottom it doesn't stay put on the table maybe something that they can improve on maybe make this really really flat on the bottom so they can really stand up i just started using it without the base aside from that i feel like it's super easy to use the suction like i said it did not hurt for me whatsoever as you can see the discharge solution is pretty dirty it looks milky instead of transparent like it was at the beginning so this is how my skin looks like after two weeks of using the w skin hydra facial hopefully you'll be able to see the difference because the first time i filmed it the lighting was a little off but i can definitely tell you that my skin has improved so much it actually went back to my original state of not having too many problem areas on my skin i'm able to not have to wear foundation anymore except maybe a little bit of concealer under the eye and that's pretty much it so i'm so happy this device literally saved my skin i'm not even joking let's take a closer look at how my skin is today and then we'll use the device again one more time and show you the difference before and after okay we're getting really close and personal right here so as you can see my forehead has improved drastically from the very first time when i still had a ton of problems on my t-zone but my forehead has smoothed out so much i do still have a few sort of uh, hyperpigmentation that is healing and tiny little like i have a little clogged pore right here very very pesky very stubborn ones that did clear a little bit after using the first time but you know they are just super stubborn because they're right in the middle of the t-zone i have maybe like a tiny one right here um another tiny one right here another tiny one right here but overall above my brows and overall on my forehead area it has smoothed out so significantly that even from afar, if I don't wear any foundations, which I don't like to wear foundations on my forehead because that's my problem area, it's completely fine because before that I had so many 
blemishes and bumps that if I didn't wear a little bit of foundation or a little bit of concealer, it would just look so bad. Running my fingers through my nose. Yeah, they are uh, a lot smoother than the first time, but it has been two weeks since I used it and a little bit of buildup has occurred, but not bad at all. Right here in the eye area, I had a bit of a plugged pore and I did use the hydrofacial device as a spot treatment and it really did help. And right now it's healing already, as you can tell, it's just trying to heal. Um, as per normal, these are my sunspots or these are my liver spots. So they are completely flat. There's nothing wrong with them aside from the hyperpigmentation, which uh, I think aside from laser, you can't really do much about it, but I'm okay with it because usually the blush will just cover a bit of it. The other area that I used to have such a big problem is right on the corners of the mouth and here and as well as the jawline right here. I had so many little bumps right here of clogged pores and I kid you not, after using this hydrofacial the first time, it smoothed them out so much. So much so that right now it's mostly smooth and I'm just waiting to use it a second time because you're supposed to use it every week or every two weeks if you have dry skin to really, really get optimal results. Sometimes my pores get a little bit uh, clogged right here, like the very, very tiny pores too. Uh, they never get too problematic, but I do notice them. And then of course, the chin area. The first time I actually used a lot of it and I do find that it runs pretty quick. So I'm just gonna put 10 right now and we'll see if we need extra because my skin has gotten so much better and I will probably mostly just do my T-zone. Now that my skin has cleared out so much, I feel like it just needs a boost and it will get even better. So let's put it back in. You just need to slide it in and voila. So now the tube is touching the solution. It knows that it's filled. And as you can see, the solution is clear. It's important to use either their solution or you can use your own, but make sure that it is a clear solution made for aqua facial. Here is the large cleaning head tip and then as you can see it is just silicone and it has two little holes one is for the solution to come through and the other one is for suctioning just plug it in it's super easy there's only one way to plug it i've never been to a salon hydrofacial but um i'm really happy with this one so i totally think that this is worth the money worth the investment for the long term and especially if you've tried everything and you just don't know what else to do uh this is this is the solution. I really do think that you should try this. So let's go ahead and turn it on. Change it to blue level. And we'll do our forehead together. So you don't want to tilt the machine too much. Tilt your head instead. And you want to do short, shorter strokes. You want to concentrate on your problem areas. So let's do this. With consistent use, you're supposed to remove fine lines and wrinkles, plump up your skin as the suction increases circulation and triggers the skin to heal. I think that's absolutely true, which also boosts your collagen and elastin, reduces acne breakouts. That is absolutely true for me. It does say to not use the device directly on acne, but I still did because I absolutely like to concentrate on the areas that were the problem areas. But my acnes are not like the cystic acnes. For me, it's like clogged pores basically. So I think it's okay. And again, it depends on your skin condition. If you have very serious health issues and of course consult with your doctor first. Some of the common questions that you might be asking is whether this is the same as microdermabrasion or diamond peel. It is similar, but it's not exactly the same thing, but it does give you very similar results because with microdermabrasion or diamond peel, it uses hard tips or metal tips on your face. And of course you can only get that at the salon, which apparently tends to be a lot harsher. I have not tried those, so I cannot really comment. Whereas the hydrafacial is so much more gentle. The technology or the idea behind it is to work the same way. One treatment is about 15 minutes, maybe half an hour. Cleaning solution has emptied out and has transferred towards here. And as you can see, it's super cloudy. It has 
all kinds of sediments inside. That's essentially all the gunk that it sucked out today, which is super satisfying if you ask me. I'm gonna do some close-ups, but as you can see, my skin has been cleansed. I think it looks a lot glowier. I'm gonna still go ahead and wash my skin, put on my skincare. Yes, it's definitely smoother. I can tell. Even though my skin was already dramatically improved from the first time, which was two weeks ago, I can tell after another treatment, which you would hope so, that it really did remove more gunk out. And of course, I did concentrate a lot on the center of my face where most of my clogged pores are. And I can tell that little bumpy one that was there earlier that really stubborn one has flattened out as well. I can tell. You can just tell by touching it because that's where you would be able to really feel the difference. Of course, you still see some old blemishes where the hyperpigmentation settled, but I'm hoping that with time, these will go away more and more. As of right now, I just use concealer to hide them when I get ready. Uh, but in general, while I am running my fingers through, I am telling you my nose area, I don't know if the camera will be able to pick it up, but my nose feels super smooth now. It was kind of a little bumpy, just, you know, from general skin texture. And I can tell this whole area here has smoothed out. Yeah, my lip area here, the corner of my mouth has smoothed out as well. Usually the chin gets the most congestion and it has smoothed out as well. The side of my chins, they have smoothed out as well. You can really tell the difference right away, even after your very first use. And of course, my cheeks have always been fine, but I like to do like a quick one pass at the end just to finish off the liquid. Hey guys, so I just came back from washing my face. I was running my hand through my whole skin and it's so soft. I am not kidding you. It is so, so effective this hydrafacial machine is definitely something i would recommend to incorporate into your routine i went ahead and washed my face with the aloe vera um, skin cleanser from davida and i'm gonna go ahead with the cucumber cooling toner from davida as well and just spritz my face i am going ahead with the brocco fusion um, moisturizer which is super thick like that but i'd like to go ahead and apply that while my skin is still damp and usually i do it right away but i'm talking to you guys and then i'll go ahead with a little bit of eye cream so this is also from uh, the same company using broccoli extracts and mushroom extracts and like i said this um this line is rather thick it has more of a creamy thicker consistency and that's pretty much it anything that's left over usually when my hands are still kind of moist i just uh, rub it on my neck and that's pretty much it that's my skincare routine it's very simple yet very effective and the more simple it is for me anyway it works best because if there's like a million steps then i wouldn't want to do it and the fact that with the hydrafacial you only need it to do uh, once every two weeks or once every week if you have very oily skin it really goes a long way into helping your skin heal so that all your simple skincare can actually work and all you need is that once once in a while boost to really help your skin clear up hey guys it's future amy today is july 27th 11 p.m so it's almost july 28th and i just wanted to show you my skin is really really good now my forehead there is almost nothing going on and the only sort of spots that you see they are mostly hyperpigmentation from acne scars but they have healed up beautifully same with my jaw so i am so happy with the improvements on my skin and um yeah, I, I just love it. I just love it. So let me know if you're gonna give the W Skin Aqua Facial a try. And if you do, please let me know how it's going for you because 
I really truly believe that this was a game changer. It has become a permanent addition incorporated into my skincare routine. I love the fact that I can just do it every two weeks or as needed because like I said, I did have some new blemishes pop up during the two week healing period, but after I used it, it just healed up so much faster than if I didn't have this machine helping me out. I've been using it just even as a spot treatment and it's been wonderful. So don't forget to check out the links down below if you're interested and use my coupon code to save 15% at checkout. And thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you found this helpful. And in case you've only just bumped into this video because you were looking for the review, then thank you for watching. But if you would like to subscribe, I do a lot of, usually I do a lot of fashion and luxury related videos. So I would love to have you back. In any case, Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys again very soon. Bye.